Well, a simple shift to the east in the storm track led to a much different outcome from what was forecasted. Parts of the area did get massive amounts of snow, in fact, up to 30 inches, but Central Park received just under 10 and areas west of the Hudson, much less. So what happened? When the models are screaming at you that there's going to be two feet of snow, it's very difficult to ignore, especially in a highly uh, metropolitan area such as we are in. The storm did, in fact, shift several miles to the east, taking the heavy snow to Nassau and especially Suffolk County, where 30 inches did fall. But Dr. Paul Croft from Keene University says the models today are light years ahead of just a few years ago. If, if you go back in modeling history, uh, even 10, 15 years ago, uh, you have to keep in mind these are the types of storms that might have been missed entirely by the forecast models. Now, forecasting is a very complex science, and it does have much room for improvement. But even though we didn't get two feet of snow in Midtown, it certainly was enough to slow things down. Back to you.